Welcome back to Blind Bags with Lauren. Thank you so much for coming back to watch a second video. I was very happy to see that some of y'all had actually watched the first one and to get some good responses back from it. So here I am with my second one. Let's just start. We're gonna start off today with this My Little Pony um, Cutie Mark Magic Blind Bag. I believe this is series 12. And in each of these blind bags, you get a pony and a collector card. I haven't opened any of these yet, so let's see who we get. So it comes with a little um, checklist, and it looks like we're gonna get Firecracker Burst. Ooh, she is super pretty. Look at her. I love the colors and her little flame on the side. So Firecracker Burst loves surprises. And is she on this list somewhere? Yep, she is right there. Sorry, that's off to the side a little bit. She's right there. Cool, all right, that's our first one. Okay, this is actually one of, something from one of those little 50 cent machines that you find at the store. Um, this one came from one called Fossil Friends, I think. Said that it was gonna be some little dinosaurs in the collection. Um, I picked up a couple of these, but I'm just going to open one today. So let's see who we have in here. Oh, what is this? This is so cute. I have no idea what kind of dinosaur this is, but he is really cute. He's kind of squishy. Not, not too much, but a little bit. And he's got a little hole in the bottom, so I bet you could put him like on the top of a pencil if you wanted to, you know, have him with you if you were at school. He is super cute. If you know what kind of dinosaur that might be, let me know, because I have no idea. Okay, I don't know if y'all have seen these Star Wars Micro Machines. I think these are super cool. Um, this is the Series 2. Um, I've only opened a couple of these so far, um, but there are a ton of these out there. I don't, I don't even know how many, but I'm excited to see what we get today. It's like, ooh, we got a little ship. in there kind of good. Oh, there we go. Okay. All right. Star Wars fans, I don't know what kind of ship this is either, <laughs> but it looks like it's got a couple little stormtroopers inside, or maybe those are snow troopers. Wow. I'm sorry. <laughs> I really do like Star Wars. I'm just not exactly sure what this is. So if y'all know, let me know. But I just think these are super cool and they're nice little cheap figures. These cost maybe like two or three dollars depending on where you pick them up. So look, take a look for those in your store. Okay, so this is what I'm super excited to open today. Um, the Monster High Minis. I'm sure some of y'all have seen some other people opening up these on their channels, um, but they've been getting them in blind bags. And as you can hear, this is not a bag. <laughs> I believe this is considered to be their coffin um, so inside you get one surprise figure and a collector's guide. So this is series one and there's over 70 different characters to collect. I've only seen a couple of the movies, so I'm not positive that I'm going to know the names of the characters yet, but I'm excited to see who we get and hopefully it's one I recognize. <laughs> Definitely going to get more of these though, because the ones that I've seen opened are so cute. Okay, that should do it. Good plastic. <laughs> okay. Let's see if there's a special way you're supposed to open this. It's like it comes apart right there. <gasps> I actually know this one. I believe this is Draculaura. And she is super cute. I just watched the movie, um, what is it, When Ghouls Fall in Love, that was about her and Claude, and it was so cute. I love the detail on these. They really do a lot to get even the, you know, teeny tiny details of each of the characters in there. She's got a little something on her head I'll have to try and get off later, but oh, these are so cute. 
So let's take a look at this little thing she came in. Okay, so this is made to look kind of like their lockers. Um, it's got a, a lock on the side with a little skull and the Monster High logo, and it's even got the lines in it like a locker. So I guess this is more of a coffin locker. And it's, I don't know that you can see it, but there's even the skull on the inside too. So you can display your little characters inside their coffins, coffin lockers. Let's see. She should be part of series one. That should be her right there. And as a blue, she is a common. But like I said on the package, it said there are over 70 to collect. Um, I've only seen people open any from this section one. So I don't know if they're gonna come out with different waves of the circus power, um, getting ghostly, beach ghouls, ragdoll ghouls, sleepover, candy, um, pattern or space monsters. I guess maybe they'll come out with those later or you're just really lucky if you find one of those now. <laughs> Who was your favorite character from Monster High? I I really like Frankie. I think she's probably my favorite. Where is she on here? Um, is that Frankie? I don't remember. No, maybe that's her. I don't know, but they're just so cute, and I am very excited to open some more of these in the future, and I hope that y'all like them. All right, so today we had the My Little Pony um, Firecracker Burst, tiny little unknown dinosaur, the little Star Wars figure, and Draculaura. Um, I think my favorite today is going to have to be Draculaura, just because I was so excited to open up that figure and start that set. So if y'all have um, anything that you want to see me open in the future, let me know and let me know down in the comments who your favorite character was from today. Thanks!